who's going to be Sinvent? I think well, for South Africa, uh, from what I've been researching, Matt Damon. Fred, you're a great comedian, but you're not a rugby guy, so leave it to professionals. Eddie O'Sullivan, you think you're shoveling all the rugby? England. Played the better rugby so far in the tournament. I think South Africa are going to win because South Africa did a much better job beating Wales as opposed to England beating New Zealand. South Africa are going to get 10 tries and a point maybe and then there'll be a lot of penalties caused by England. That's five. England, that's five. It'll be tight five. enough. So that's thirty-five. No one actually. Seven I'd tries. Say thirty. For the South South thirty-five for New Zealand. I definitely think South Africa would be thirty-five. England, twenty-five. Mm, final sixteen nine to England. So I can see England getting the first try. I think they'll probably score the first and only try. I don't see it's a high-scoring game. Maybe six minutes into it. Maybe seven. Probably around the first quarter, 20 minutes. Probably South Africa. England are going to cause most penalties because then, you know, they'll get extra time. An extension, you could almost say. Unfortunately, you know, England, you're not going to get much of an extension on this one. You won't have Barnier. He's nothing to do with rugby. Probably with the high tackle law at the moment, it's possible somebody gets sent bent without intentionally hitting somebody high. I think, I think it might be Ben Kinsley because he seems to be on the bench a lot and he's so infuriated that he's on the bench that that anger will come out if he does get a chance to go on the pitch, which ironically will put him back in the bench in the sin bin for a good 10 minutes. Possibly for England, uh, Courtney Laws. Possibly for South Africa, uh, Peter Stiff to Toit. Well, hopefully they'll be all lined out, looking well. But if you had to pick a team, I'd say uh, England will have the most line-outs because that'll be them killing time. Again, two very good line-outs, although England have really only two jumpers. Uh, probably South Africa will dominate the line-out. Looking for the extension. You know yourself. Eddie, you ain't that steady with your rugby. Because I don't think you're ready. Eddie can't rap. Give him that. He might know something about rugby, but he can't rap. He can't freestyle. <laughs>